from Dr. Joe and I am to lovethatface.com and today we're going to take off some DPNs which are very common uh, benign little skin tags uh, frequently seen on African American patients. We're going to use the Elman radio wave surgery which is one of my favorite ways of doing this. We also use the 532 or the 940 laser. Um, with this machine tuned to the uh, proper settings. You can really do this without any uh, local anesthesia. Um, you just don't want to stay on the skin with a long contact time. And we're going to do this uh, on an awake patient and we'll uh, talk to him as we're doing it. So this patient is awake and I am uh, voicing over this video because with the particular video camera we're using, which is a great high definition video, it makes a very loud buzz when you activate the almond. Um, and we don't hear that buzz on our end, it's just interference. So what we're doing is uh, we have our pure cutting using the 133 electrode, and we usually set the Elman anywhere between 12 and 20 uh, watts on the pure cutting. And if you uh, use local anesthesia, then you can uh, use a long dwell time on these lesions. Um, however, when you're... Um, uh, doing them without uh, local anesthesia, which uh, we sometimes do, what you want to do is just do really little short spurts, tap, 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 and uh, enough to disrupt the tissue. These are not uh, really deep, and uh, they wipe off quite easily. And uh, most people can tolerate this uh, without any anesthesia. However, some supplemental local infiltration uh, is also helpful. So obviously, if you're doing this without anesthesia, you want to use the lowest setting you can, which you, you really want to do across the board with radio wave or electrosurgery. <clears throat> the key to this is to find a, a setting where you'll ablate the tissue. Uh, if you're sparking, it's too high. And if you're dragging in the tissue or, or not ablating it, then it's too low. So these really tiny little DPNs are extremely easy to treat. Uh, and they're, they're not painful, and it's not uncommon that we may do several hundred of these uh, on a patient at one time. So what you do is just ablate, and then the assistant uh, wipes the char off, and uh, using the lowest setting possible and being conservative gives the uh, best cosmetic result. And people can come in and do, uh, sometimes I'll sedate somebody and do hundreds of these at one time, or more often people come in and uh, do a handful uh, at any given time and return and do this on a regular basis until they're happy. Uh, many people don't want all of these gone, just the biggest ones. And cosmetically, it's possible um, that you'll remove the lesion and you can still see uh, a little area uh, of brown spot as I'll show you in uh, some before and after pictures. Uh, however, these lesions do real well and patients are extremely happy and this is a great way to treat DPNs uh, with the Elman 4.0 megahertz radio wave surgery system.